it is a network of pool players. Players who are interested in opting their game from being local players in bars. They want to up their game to become sportsmen. And that's why the alliance was set up. So for pool and snooker players that watch people like Dink, like Sullivan, like Trump, that's you Trump, some of these great pool players and snooker players that we watch on television. Here locally in Nigeria, a structure is being created and that structure is being created under the alliance. Among the things the alliance has introduced is a ranking system. That means when you play, you have the opportunity of getting ranked. When you form your ranking, you now have the opportunity as you grow in your ranking, if I'll put it that way, as you grow in your ranking, you now have the opportunity of playing at different levels against different class of opposition. Under the alliance, there are different tours, tournaments and circuits. We are, what we are here witnessing is the Interbar. It's a series of eight tournaments. It's restricted to bars. Why? Because the bar is the natural home of snooker and pool. Not only even snooker and pool, you have other noble sports that you find in the bar. Things like chess, things like darts. So the bar, ordinary, in, in its natural state, must be a place of entertainment. And sports is one way we create entertainment within the bar environment. Um, what we have locally in Nigeria is bars just put pool tables there for players to play with the objective that it will help them sell. Yes, we agree that it will help them sell. But beyond that, these sports have become very big internationally, big global sports. There are now World Cup of Pool, there is World Cup of Snooker, there is Snooker Masters, Pool Masters, different big events. And many of these sports are even televised sports. That means you can watch them on television. And one way by which, through which you can watch them on television is that um, it attracts viewership. It attracts viewership. So we have now created what we call the interbar uh, in eight ball pool. We have interbar eight ball pool. We are going to have interbar nine ball pool. We are going to have interbar snooker. We are going to have a lot of these pools at the bar level because the bar is the natural home. We believe if we, if with that, we'll be attracting more bars to come into the alliance, that the pool, pool players, and uh, snooker and pool players alliance. The Taba is meant for just the highest rank players in a bar. The, 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 we like the prize money, the prize money that is being offered for this year, we have 1.6 million that is being offered to the bars. So that prize money is for the bar. It's left for the bar to know how to remunerate its players. So we, 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 we believe that with this, we can stimulate greater interest amongst bars in pool and snooker for the purpose of growing the sports. And when, once we can grow the sports, then we take it one, one notch higher. We can now start doing things like Masters, master Series. We can do things like Players' Championship. And above all, we can now dream of sending players even outside the country to go and play in South Africa. As I talk to you, we have received an invitation from the Chinese Eight Ball Pool association there's a world cup that was supposed to hold in south africa that's the chinese airboard pool world cup it was to hold in south africa and we got an invite just because of what we are doing and uh, we are hoping that if things go well according to plan the coronavirus was the one that thwarted some of the plans because everybody shutting down their borders so right now Tentatively, they have said by August, that is when the event is going to take place. So here in Nigeria, same we are doing. So we are trying to do the same. 
if we succeed, from here we can send players to go and play in the eight ball pool World Cup. We can also send players to play in the Masters. But let us get the ground level set. Let us get the foundation set. And the foundation is here back home in Nigeria. I will encourage other bars to affiliate to the Alliance, to join in, support what the, the work that is going on. And even other players, because by joining in and supporting, it gives them an opportunity to get ranked. And when you get ranked, you get an opportunity to know what position you are on, on, the, on the national scale. So at the end of the day, um, you will not just be a, a pool player or a snooker player. You will become an athlete. There's a difference between being a player and an athlete. Totally different. And that is what we are trying to achieve. And I encourage you to the players and the bars to come on board because it makes us a bigger family.